my name is Xiomara from Belly Passion. Welcome to Belly Dance Level 1. In this video, we're going to work on Algerian shimmies and three quarter shimmies. In previous videos, we saw the Egyptian shimmy with the knee straight. And then we saw the basic shimmy with the knees bent. And then we'll review the twist. In this video, we're going to see how we can perform a three quarter shimmy in an Nigerian shimmy, which is a big part of the whole shimmy family. So what we're going to do, we're going to start with the Algerian shimmy. We're going to imagine we're going to draw half circles to the floor, on, on the walls, on the side, with the hips. So we're going to start. One, two, three. Lift, twist, down. With your feet, I want you to imagine you're like marching, like right, left, right, left. But I want you to be settled with your feet because if you lift too much, it can affect the way your Algerian shimmy looks and it can take away from your hips. So what you want to do is you want to take your arms out. We're going to draw half circle to the front, half circle to the front, half circle to the front, half circle to the front. Always relaxing your knees. This is very important. We're not going to touch and then step, touch and then step, no. What I want you to do is keep marching and then what we're going to do is take the hip with it. But I want you to push your hips to the front. So at the same time, you're lifting your foot, you're lifting your hip and throwing it to the front. So, if you have imaginary pencils on your hips, you are drawing one half circle, one half circle, one half circle, one half circle. Again, let's start with the right hip. Lift and drop, lift and drop, lift and drop, lift and drop. And I really want you to tuck in that hip towards your ribcage. If you don't, it's going to look just like a shimmy, but a walking shimmy. The Algerian shimmy has to look like a twist, 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 twist. So you're always sending your hips left to right, left to right. Let's start again. One and four. My weight is on the right. Every time you throw your hip to the front, you put your weight on it. Make sure, as I said, don't throw the hip and don't step on it. You have to step on it right away. So, don't touch. Just step on it. Step. Step. Remember the march? And step. 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 The more comfortable you get with this step, the less you want to lift your feet. You just want to keep your toes glued to the floor so you can lift your heels but not your toes. One, two, one, two. And remember, it's a shimmy. A shimmy is a fast movement of the body, or of a part of a body. So, right now, the Algerian, we're going to make it into a shimmy. And make sure it's very flat and grounded. One, two, twist, four, five, six, seven, eight. But let's try this with music. Five, six, seven, eight. Let's start from the beginning. Make sure when you step, your knee is relaxed. You don't want to lock your knees. Relax your knees. Forward, forward. Let's focus on the right hip. Right, step together. You to lift and drop your hip to the front. Lift, drop your hip on the front. Half circle. Half circle. Step right, step left. Step right, step left. 
which are the hip bumps to the side and the hip drop. So the three quarter shimmy is composed of these two movements. Now three quarters is three movements in four times of the music. There's a four time where it's a hold. We're not going to do anything. So it's going to go hip on to the right, your weight is on the right, and a hip drop on the left. We're going to bump to the left and a hip drop on the right hip. When we go and put the weight on the right, it's impossible for us to do a hip drop when we have the weight on it. That's why you take turns. You do a hip bump, the foot that is free, that's the one that lift, lifts and drops. So you go side, lift and drop. Side, lift and drop. In the difference with the Algerian shimmy, we were going front, 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 front. The three-quarter shimmy is a movement that moves very horizontal. We're going from left to right, left to right. Okay? So the hips are moving right and then left. In between those two, you have a hip drop. So you're going to go right, up, down, left, up, down. Make sure that we're not going hip bump, stepping together and go, stepping out and go. You actually just place your feet shoulder width apart and you go out. Don't move the left leg. That right there you put your hip drop. And then on the left, and you put your hip drop. And then on the right, hip drop. And then on the left, hip drop. One, two, three, four. The four is a hold. One, two, three, four. 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 One, two, three. 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 When you perform the three quarter shimmy fast, the hold actually what you do is that you talk in. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. So the four, it's still there, but it's so fast that all you can do is just hold up there. One, two, three, 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 one, two, three. For now, we're just gonna go one, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Step on the right, hip drop on the left. Step on the left, hip drop on the right. Step on the right. Make sure don't step out. Just place your feet and leave them there. Make sure your knees are always together. Imagine you're dancing with a tight skirt. And one, two, three. Remember, it's a shimmy. So when we take it fast, Five, six, seven, and let's try this with music. Five, six, 